Based in Los Angeles, Lafitte Supercars designs unique concept cars and manufactures short-run automobiles. This week, the company introduced the X-Road, a street-legal all-terrain vehicle that combines off-road power with high-end luxury. The X-Road delivers up to 700 horsepower and weighs just 2,866 pounds, which gives the driver a horsepower to pound ratio of 4.09 pounds per horsepower. Now, that won't exactly put it in the top 10, where supercars like the Hennessy Venom GT2 has a horsepower to pound ratio of 55.87. But according to the company, that does give it the best performance from an all-terrain supercar. The car has a 17-inch suspension travel that allows drivers to jump like a Dakar Rally prototype in the desert or casually drive through the neighborhood. The company is only making 30 of them and plans to start delivering them by the end of 2020. However, the starting price is a steep $465,000. If you want an electric version, you can tack on another 80K just to start. Lafitte Supercars is owned by former professional race car driver Bruno Lafitte and his wife Leticia. The company has operations in LA, Miami, and Valencia, Spain, but the final car assembly will take place at the Los Angeles facilities and the car is registered for the road in California. Bruno is also the nephew of legendary Formula One driver Jacques Lafitte. Now, if the car looks familiar, that's because it's nearly identical to the Sand Racer 500 GT that debuted in December 2015. In June 2017, supercar manufacturer Zaruk Motors announced that the luxury supercar was ready for limited production. Now, the launch had some eerie similarities. For example, the initial production run was going to be 35 cars instead of 30, and it started at 450,000 instead of 465. Oh, and one of Zaruk Motors' founders, former professional race car driver Bruno Lafitte, nephew of legendary Formula One driver Jacques Lafitte. The Sand Racer was once called the off road Lamborghini of Arabia. Now, the company has all but disappeared. Let's hope the X Road doesn't suffer a similar fate.